create ultra realistic shadow effects with this awesome Photoshop plugin in Photoshop 2021 and beyond. I'm going to quickly show you how to install an awesome Photoshop premium plugin called Shadowify, which can help you create ultra realistic shadows. You can get perspective shadows, you can get flat shadows, you can get warped and blurred shadows, and you can create long shadows. It's simple and easy to install, and the results are far more effective than the likes of your bog standard drop shadow. So let's get started. So to start, we're gonna to need to download this plugin. You'll need Photoshop's Creative Cloud, and you'll need to go to elements.envato.com and create an account. Account. If you create a paid account, you get a seven day free trial. So once you've created your account, you can come in and look for a plugin called Shadowify. Once you've found Shadowify, you can come to the second version of Shadowify and you can download the plugin. For license purposes, make sure you assign a license to this plugin. So I'm going to assign it to the Design with Dale Add Shadow tutorial. And once you've created your license, you can add and download. You can download without a license, but you will be limited as to what you can use it for. And you won't be able to use it for commercial purposes. Once the plugin is downloaded, so I've put my download into my plugins folder, select the folder and come to the CCX file and double click it to execute it. If Adobe can't verify the plugin, check install locally. From there, press OK. And from there now, in your Creative Cloud account, in Stock and Marketplace and Plugins and Manage Plugins, you should see now Shadowfy 2 has been installed. So once you've exited Creative Cloud, come back into Photoshop, and then if you go to Plugins, you should now see the Shadowfy 2 plugin has been installed. From there, all you need to do is select Shadowify 2. This will now bring up your Options panel, and here you've got the option of four different types of shadows, and you can also apply Blur and Warp to these two. So select the layer you'd like to apply the shadow to. So I'm going to select my camera layer. Let's go for a simple flat shadow. And from there, then it will bring up the options you need to use. Each shadow has a multitude of settings and options you can choose from. So feel free to play around with angle, distance, opacity, and everything else in between. Once you create a shadow you like and you want to save it, you can also come to presets and simply click save and that will save these settings. And once you're happy with your settings, all you need to do is click create shadow and it will create a new layer for you. And from there now you can see it's created the shadow layer, which you can toggle on or off, and you can mess around accordingly. Some of these filters will take a little time for Photoshop to run, so be patient with it, particularly if you're operating on a computer with lower RAM and graphics card. But if you're looking to create some cool, hyper-realistic shadow effects like these that I've already pre-made, then Shadowfy is a great way to do this. So I hope you found this premium Photoshop tutorial helpful. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, keep on designing, and I will see you for the next tutorial.